Welcome back to Let's Play a Boy and His Blob. I'm Burning Dog Face, and that frog sure seems to be making Blobbert agitated. We are here in the, uh, the first world to... What is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Are you seeing this shit? No, you're still distracted by the frog. Well, god damn it, I said I was gonna start this episode with uh, the challenge levels, and I didn't mean to. But now I'm really curious about that. I'll be totally honest, I was actually planning to uh, do one level and then. Oh, there's four. I was actually planning to do one level and. Uh, and then go back for that last blob I totally forgot about at the end of the previous video, but... Now I might go into World 11. I mean, that would basically boil down... That would. That will basically boil down to me uh, going through, was it, 4 or 6? With a, uh, with a walkthrough, just to make sure I don't r miss it, because... Well, there's nothing indicating where they are other than the squeaking of the cages. Oh, shit, I didn't start my timer. Really glad I looked at that. Ahem. We've got nothing but the pear parachute and the blue... and the... Uh, sorry, then the berry balloon. Look, I know it's a blueberry, you know it's a blueberry, but that's not what they call it. There's a way to make your stuff fall faster. Other than that, I mean. I think that might be what this one is about. What a beautiful this planet can be sometimes. Can being the operative word. Oh, and there's no treasure chest indicator in the corner at all. I was curious about that. No. Mainly because I didn't get an achievement for, uh... Oh yeah, if you hold, if you hold up or down on the stick, you gradually accelerate or decelerate your falling. Oh, I was hoping to land exactly on it. Yeah. That wasn't too bad at all. Now, do I rescue the prisoner? He doesn't even need to be a prisoner anymore. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. There's actually rewards for this shit. More concept art. Oh, I really like the fist. I'm sad they didn't do that. Oops. Can I get stop on each one? Uh, okay. I do like the one where they're both flopped down. A tightrope is pretty fun. <laughs> the high five is my favorite. Billy, no! You can't give him every jelly bean at once. It's a good thing they don't make him turn into animals, because giving him every jelly bean at once would otherwise turn him into turn him into John Carpenter's The Thing, but Snow White. Uh, Snow White, the physical description, not Snow White, the character, because that would be really weird. Although I bet someone's drawn that, all things being equal. No! Oh. 
What do I do? I don't have any jelly beans. I must have run out. I can't take my friend like that. See the audition for the kid who played Elliot in E.T.? Kid didn't even really know what, the, what was going on at the time, but... God damn, could he sell the emotion. Like, all they told him was, you know... You have a special friend, and these men w are trying to convince you to let your friend go away forever. And the kid actually starts crying right there. But he's my friend! I don't want him to go, and all that. Well, I, yeah, I think we found the kid. I'm coming, Blobbert. I don't know why I'm looking. There's not going to be anything here. I can't collect treasure chests without Blobbert. No! Blob! No! Achievement unlocked! Lock and load! Oh. My. <laughs> it's a fucking mech! Got the, uh, the licorice ladder, the punch hole, the b berry balloon, and the mulberry mech. I don't know. I think I should have done this level last, you guys. What was that achievement for? Turn into a mech for the first time. But there's two exits. One under the hole. Oh, no, I just... Oh, and there's chests now! Man, what? Well, I guess we use the mech. Achievement unlocked, had a light breakfast. What is this? Feed Blob one of each of the jelly beans. I had wondered about that. Oh. Oh, I see. You can't hold it forever. That's as much as you can do. Oh, shit. No! Embarrassing. Died anyway. Activate! Lock 
Hell yes! Sorry, I just wanted a really convenient editing spot, because I'm going to send that to some of my friends without any context later today. Uh... Very good boy, Blobbert. <laughs> oh, let's just use the ladder to get out of here. <laughs> it seems everything seems so silly now that I have this. can't go in like this, sadly. Oh, right, no, those, that guy will just straight up kill me if I do that. <clears throat> Solve that problem. Oh, no! Oh, right. I love that the joysticks spawn in after he climbs in. I also love that there's no glass in that quote-unquote window. <laughs> this is so stupid, and I love it! Oh. I knew that. Like, we did use a Game Genie to cheat ourselves all of the, uh, the jelly beans right at the beginning of the game back in the day. So while I haven't, you know, beaten the game, I did see jelly beans. You don't start the game with, like, the, the Lime Key, for example. You know, a joke on Key Lime Pie. But, um... I'm telling you, there weren't any mechs in that game. Say hello to my little friend. Hey, shithead. Why don't you pick on someone your own size? Okay, to check in. No, I don't have the cannons, so they're not being clever about this. We just get to smash those guys. Clearly meant to be the end of the experience. Shit. Oh! Well, that does mean I'll probably have to restart. So we'll get ourselves. Oh, we can just hold it! Can you even imagine how much more satisfying the boss fight against the Emperor of Blabonia would have been if we had just beaten the fucking shit out of him? Fuck. 
nothing I can stand on. Where did that come from? I didn't even see that, to be perfectly frank. Oh, hell yeah! One thing bothering me. That would be the fact that the, uh. the thing that grabbed poor Blobbert was dark gray, like the bosses we fought, other than the Emperor himself. We get to come back. That's all that means. Unless this unlocks level 5 or something. World 5, rather. Oh, these ones are just filled with treasure, all. That's all. There is a second thing there. Okay. We're going to call that the end game. <laughs> it's a plunger on a stick. That was amazing, Blubbert. And to think, Billy's mom wanted him to get a dog. <laughs> oh, I love that. Maybe that'll make more sense with the third piece. Uh, where the fuck? Oh, there. They're not oriented in anything close to order, so... My incredible powers of observation tell me that I either have the trampoline or the la the, uh, the ladder. I have the hole, I have the ladder, and I have the balloon. Remember all that stuff I was really grumpy about last time? I take back most of it. <laughs> I mean, it's still not cool that they don't tell you anything. Let's not be, let's not be hasty about this or anything. But, uh... You have a friend now! Hmm. But yeah, just, that was hilarious. That bizarre power trip right at the end. I like that. That's actually a really good way to do catharsis. I, I have to say that. Okay, but that doesn't make any fucking sense. I can't get over there. Oh! Ready? I forgot I could do that. And then I remembered. I actually got a comment from somebody who said they beat the game without knowing he could do that. So that felt made me feel pretty good. It was Miracle Tiger who left that comment. Shout out! I guess that uh, A Boy and His Blob really isn't the most well explained video game, huh? Wait. 
That's a problem. Because that is as far as I can move it. Oh, want a second, probably just wait. Yeah, yeah, let's just move. And no treasure chest in this level, so let's just go. Not bad. That was challenging, you know, for level 5. For level 1, 5, let's be clear about that. We have satisfied the spirit of the mask. And it has rewarded us with concept art. Calm down. You stay there, I'll be right back. Oh, wait. Yeah, one last level, but we'll save that for later. Now that I realize what it is. Okay, general forest vibes, sure. Nice. General Swamp vibes, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, timer. Well, this has been a very eventful episode. Blobbert died. Blobbert was resurrected through the emotions of a child. And then we wreaked... Well, not bloody havoc, but surely goo splattered havoc all up on they asses. We made them regret that they ever messed with Earth at all. I have to imagine that was some kind of vengeance for the Emperor. Still, that gray hand bothers me. And as much as it was a hand. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play A Boy and His Blob. When you continue making your way through challenge levels, and, uh, this game continues to get more interesting somehow. <laughs> it just keeps doing that. Later!